What up, what up, what up? Welcome to the Weird the Weird Wars podcast. Just can't hit me just yet. Mm. I really listen to some old Gretchen Wilson or something. Gretchen Wilson. Yeah. Fuck <clears> yeah, <throat> I'm wrong, but is your name Gretchen? <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. We were idiots, bro. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. All right, bro. man. We gonna roll in off that energy. Stupid. <laughs> What up, what up, what up? Welcome to episode 124 Where the Weird Ones <laughs> Podcast. I go by the name of Keenan. We got Johnny in the building. Do? We got Lundaring in the building. Present. And we got Chris in the building. Yo, what's up? How's everybody feeling this week? Bang, feeling bang. good, man. I feel like I'm about to win two Monaco's. You said what? Dang. What? I'm about to win two the feet all, or You about to win already? two Monaco's? Yes, sir. How are you going to win those two Monaco's, sir? Oh, let me tell. Do, do tell. Do tell. Do tell. <laughs> I took a bet. 49ers versus Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Mm. And, uh, I got the Buccaneers. Who's got the 49ers? I found a sucker to take them. You found a sucker, huh? Yes, sir. Oh, yes, sir. my goodness. What does that sucker have a name? I don't want to say no names, but it start with Chris. So if they, win, <laughs> if they win by 21, you owe me double? For sure. All right, bet. That's, that's the bet. That's a jealous bet right there. Yeah. That's a crazy bet. That's I mean, that's purpose. cool when it's just two Monaco's, but. Yeah. Yeah. Because I think Tampa could get them by 21. No. Please let me know. We're going to get that text later on. I got the worst luck ever. <laughs> yeah. Let's see. I'm done. How was your week, man? Or what you got going? Um, it Let's was, talk about it. It was pretty cool, man. It just it was kind of it was kind of chill at work a little bit. So. You want to vent to the people? Tell them what, you know, what no, I ain't got nothing to vent, man. Just a little stuffy, but I'm good. Right. I watched my two favorite Christmas movies this week, so. A Christmas story? No. Uh, Toy Story? I like that movie. This Christmas and... Uh, I like this Christmas. The Polar Express? And almost, I watched The Polar and Express. And Almost Christmas. I like Wait, what's Almost Christmas? Almost Christmas with DC? Yeah. Uh, I like that, that one, one. Bro. That Is that the one with DC and Monique? Yeah. yeah. Okay. I yeah. like that one too. Yeah. That. This yeah. Christmas is Chris Brown, right? Yeah. 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 That's too I did see choices. Polar Express for the first time this weekend, though. You said the what? The first time? Polar Express. Never oh. seen that shit in my life. Like, never. Not one single minute. I've never seen it. Yeah. You had you start having kids out here. You know, okay, know I give you that, you but you should have been there. You should have seen it by now. Why? You got kids. Oh, no, man. No, no. That's a good. That's a good one. Did you enjoy? Uh, Did you enjoy it? It was cool. It was cool. It was at Crown or at Union Station. Yeah. They got like an IMAX in that joint. Yeah, I didn't the, know the, that. The planetarium or whatever. No, it's the extreme. It's called the Extreme Theater. Yeah, it's yeah, not a city yeah. place. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. It's yeah. a movie theater down there. It's like an IMAX though. The, what, the tickets was like what three fifty? Three fifty. Yeah. Three fifty. Yeah. Three fifty. What? That's a deal. Yeah. Hell yeah, you that's can't a deal. even get a sandwich for three fifty. Yeah. <laughs> three fifty. Inflation ain't <laughs> hit the theaters. Too, though. Well, if you got the McDonald's app, you be, you might luck out. <laughs> uh, it was packed too. It was a bunch of milk. I, I, I don't know. <laughs> like, did I miss it? Hey, way to catch a nigga off. Right, like, I, I don't know, but it was it was cool. It was cool. Classy women, church going, God feels. Did a uh, Christmas in the park yesterday. I can't stand Christmas in the park, bro. Yeah, bro. I haven't done it. How I long cannot. was your wait, bro? We left here at seven. We didn't get back to almost ten. Oh God. Yeah. You got to get there like before the sun go down to yeah. get through it fast. Or or you just go on the week on during the week. Night. Like on a Wednesday night, nobody's there. Yeah, so we always go on a Friday or Saturday. Random fucking you night. You get the little tree afterwards, take your pictures down on the other nah, side. Nah, we don't do that. We don't do yeah. that. I know you just hit the Christmas in the park, get that little piece of candy, go to the tree, take some pictures. Get the a magic tree? tree? Yeah. Yeah. I thought they had knocked that mug down with all that construction going on. No, over there. they, they left it up there. there for a decade. I don't know. What they I doing. think they're doing soccer over <laughs> they're there. They're doing soccer fields. Like, yeah, I, I they had like that project stadiums. over there. They're doing yeah. soccer fields over they, there. They building soccer to, fields in Kansas City, and it's supposed to connect. Well, like everywhere. I told my wife, Kansas City is like known as like the, the soccer, soccer capital, capital of the nation, yeah. bro. That's crazy. Ain't nobody here play soccer. That's a fact. <laughs> 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 That's a fact. I could play soccer, man. 
Oh, here we go. You, you just kick a you just kick a ball like man. Hey, what are you oh, doing for real? You about to have people. Man, come on. We, head, we boy, can't take are, no more slander world. in our comments, Chris. <laughs> Shit, first it was Nas. And it was gay birds last you week. Find out niggas love Meek Mill, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> music is a touchy subject. <laughs> you learn about yourself a little bit when you start doing some music reviews. And we all lame. <laughs> Damn. I thought I was cool, man. What y'all think something. about Britney Griner? Shit, fuck that nigga. No, not Brittany Griner. I'm oh, talking about. I'm about to say <laughs> that. <laughs> that came out the I'm talking about the nigga that called us lame, bro. Oh, shit. I'm about to say, wow, Yo, Keenan. Shout out to Brittany Listen, Griner getting home, man. People was I know Brittany about Griner was released from arrest in prison after a prisoner swap for Victor Boot. Victor Boot? Boot. So, you know, his name's, he's nicknamed the Merchant of Death. Because yeah. uh, he's trafficking in arms and shit. But the 2005 movie, uh, Lord of War, it was about him? Was, uh, yeah, it was supposed to be about him and the shit he's done it throughout his life. Lord of War with Nicolas Cage? With Nicolas yeah. Cage, yeah. Huh. I remember watching that movie. But Victor Boot, you know, he's this uh, notorious arms trafficker in the U.S. Caught him in Thailand back in uh, 2000. What was it? They did some sting in Thailand, basically. Called him up and said, hey. We want to buy some missiles for these Colombian rebels and shit, some surface-to-air missiles. My man was like, sure. They was like, well, pull up. And he pulled up. And they got his ass. They say, Shh. <laughs> come here, motherfucker. They catfished him. Basically. But the big deal was they they uh they charged him with basically like, yo, you getting charged with conspiracy to kill American officials, you know, for a conspiracy to kill military people and all this shit. Mm-hmm. Which, of course, you know, Russia objected to. Like, yo, bro, he wasn't even in America. Basically, y'all said anybody anywhere in the world that's selling anything that y'all don't like, y'all can say, we're going to charge you for that. You know what I'm saying? Because at the time, the Americans were helping the Colombians fight uh, the rebel groups, FARC and all them. So that's why they said, well, you know, since we helping them fight and you sold them something, we're going to charge you for that. And that's why Russia's been like, you know what I'm saying? He's been wrongfully detained for all this time. Mm. So that's why they were like, you know, y- y'all want Brittany Griner back? BG. We want Victor Boot back. Mm. So you think it was a good trade? Uh, Can, can I reserve judgment? <laughs> can, I, can I be <laughs> honest how I feel about it? Go ahead. It's, it's, your, it's, podcast. Hey, it's your podcast, man. Hey, bro. I feel like, it's a, okay, it's a lot of people that are unhappy with this trade. They like, we gave up too we much. Like we really like doing football. I'm out like here that. like, nigga, which one of you niggas has been affected by this arms dealer guy? Like, y'all buying, they, they, he dropping off AKs in the hood? Well, he's yeah. also, the, the dude is also a conspiracy of uh, terrorist attacks against the U.S. Where? Well, so they were saying that because the people who he was selling arms to. Yeah, but like he's—I don't think he's ever like done something specifically to the U.S. Well, they said it he had plans, and then you plans know, to. like the people yeah. that I see like saying she need to have her little ass back in jail and blah blah blah. I'm like nigga, you live in the hood. <laughs> like he ain't dropping AKs off in the hood. You ain't nigga. You ain't that important. Mm. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm like, and of course I understand. I understand kind of where they come from. They like, yo, we wanted to get the Marine back. We would have rather have the Wayland, Mar- Wayland. Marine still in yeah. custody in Russia. We was rather we would rather have the Marine back than Brittany Griner. You know what I'm saying? But I'm that's like, what the U.S. said. It's people saying no, that, like, like people just the, the general got people around her. Crazy, yeah. Like the general, the U.S. is up in arms right now. You got well, like a lot of women and the LGBTQ plus blah 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 people are like super happy, but then you got the Hey, yeah, I, I ain't dissing. I'm just saying. Pray to God you don't say that. And, and then you got the other people, which is you know kind of like more so. Um, what is it? Far right, far left. One of them. Left. Which ones? Which like one? the ones that know. rock with Trump? What that? Far right. Far All right. Far right people are like, oh, y'all gave up too much. Y'all, y'all, y'all gave up this vicious man that's gonna come back and threaten the. All this violence on the U.S. for a basketball player, and I'm like, mm, I don't know if that's a true. pot smoking basketball player is what they say. I don't <laughs> sure. What who was a uh, Candace Owens said that? I oh, can see her well, saying I mean, something she like that. Caught, well, what was it? A gram of hash oil, yeah. like basically, you know, cannabis oil in a vape pen. She had a gram of that. They caught her with that. Well, that's why I said I want to hear what she says because she she. But admitted, that's but they have different laws over there. That's illegal. That's over a fact. There. Yeah, yeah. But here's my thing. She admitted to that in Russia. I don't know if they forced her or not, but now she's back on American soil safe. 
I want somebody to ask her, hey, did you really take that shit to Russia just because you had a prescription in Arizona? Because she say yes, then I'm going to jump to the far right. Like, y'all should have left her ass over there. Hmm. I don't think... All right, so I look... I got... I look at this a couple ways. I agree. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, me and the wife watch this show about people trying to smuggle stuff in the countries. And no matter what country they smuggling it into... And it's like whether you using it or you smuggling it in for a cartel or whatever the case. Like if you get caught with drugs on you going through like one of these airport securities, it's like ten years off tops. That like that's like, every lock of a bronze. Yeah, like that is like the bottom line base. This is what you got. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like a ticket. Basically, you know what I'm saying. So ten, I get that. Ten. <laughs> for real. And like, bro, if you watch this show, like, bro, they be finding dope and like the craziest stuff. They be they be trying out here. You know what I'm saying? But um, so I get that, but it's like it's it's layers to this, man. It's like, was this a to me, I feel like this is like one of those, oh yeah, we got her with some weed. This is a political play we can run now. Well, you yeah, that's what, what it is too. Yeah. They know that Russia knew that they US has people that we want. So we we can hold this against the yeah, US, obviously. So, I don't they know. They tried man. to do a two for two deal. Two for one. No, they tried to do a two for two. Who was the two? I thought I don't know who the second person. I know they were doing them, but they still said no to the two for two. They not letting Wheeling go. Exactly, but that's because you know they like nah, bro. Like you, you military. You didn't like do shit to us, Mm -hmm. my boy. We we holding on to you. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. It's it's all about what the perspective that you look at things and things like that. And then you see people like, oh, I bet you she don't take her ass back out of the country. Like, yes, yeah, she will. She got to make money. Yeah. <laughs> that's yeah, that. She was over there for, she was playing she there in play the basketball. Yeah. yeah. I'm like, she got to yeah, make money. She probably just ain't going to go back to Russia. She yeah. might go to like Italy or, you know what I'm saying, France. You could probably cross like Russia and the Chinese league off your list right now. Yeah. yeah. But I mean, like, she'll go back Spain, somewhere else, so cross season, play ball. Like, she got I'm going to. to the UK. We fuck with them. They fuck with us. 21 Savage. 21, 21. <laughs> <laughs> so it all I, depends on, like, how you look at it to me. Because if you look at it, like, you say Victor Boot, like, he ain't never put guns in the hood or nothing like that. But if you somebody who has, like, family in one of those countries where he was trafficking arms that led to, like, genocide or some other shit like that, then you feel a different way. Like, no, nah, why the fuck would y'all let him out? Like, that dude is literally, they call this man the merchant of death for a fucking reason. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You everybody know a nickname. You you earn them. I mean, I'm 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 certain even with him locked up, there's plenty of niggas still getting guns at wherever these countries are. Like long, he wasn't the only niggas out here selling. How long been locked up? Said what? 2005. Uh, he got he got caught back in 2008. 2008. Been so doing 14 years. Since 2008. I'm like ain't shit stop. And he looked it's crazy. Somebody too. else to sell some some guns or something out here. He looked crazy. He looked crazy. Yeah, but you can't have that attitude towards it. Otherwise. What's the point of any law? Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, we gonna convict you for murder, but niggas still murdering, so no, I'm not I'm not questioning the law. I'm just questioning like y'all like don't let this guy out, don't do the trade, blah, blah, blah. But I'm like, even with him in jail, ain't nothing stop. No, but like we killed Osama, but he there's got still pulled terrorism. From jail? But I highly doubt we had Osama in jail. They'd be like, Yeah, we're gonna let you out. Yeah, they they we not gonna let Osama, Osama out because not for this, not for no, this. because the effect it directly had on that's our what I'm saying, and that's my saying. That, that's, saying. That's why some people are mad. Like I understand that y'all said it didn't directly affect the U.S. on the homeland that y'all don't think it did, but it did affect us in certain ways. Like it's it always comes back to blood and treasure. Like the U.S. government spent money and resources trying to catch this guy, and along the way, I'm sure there's been people that died doing these investigations. So that's why you get the people on the far right saying. No, there's no way we should let that guy out. But then you get people on the far left saying, I don't even know I don't know who the fuck this guy is. Couldn't pick him out of lineup. You know what I'm saying? That what was what he do to I us? didn't know who he was. Yeah, you get, you get those people saying, what did he ever do to us? And it's like, well, he never did nothing to us that you would probably be able to name. But if you dig down into it, like, yeah, if he traffics arms to Rwanda or something, and then, you know, they have a genocide over there. And then, you know, the U.N. is stepping in and all that shit to try to curb that shit. Then, yeah, you did affect us. Just not directly, but it's a global world. Like, most of the shit people do out here affects us (laughs) some way. 
It's a global world. I heard that too. <laughs> well, you know, I was just like, you can do something in the smallest country because America's Did like a Did you just say the same thing twice? <laughs> you know Two what I mean? Because America's be like a big peacekeeper. You can do something in a small African country and it would affect us. Yeah, that's true. Like, Ukraine got invaded. Ukraine's on the other side of the fucking world. It affects everybody. They produce a lot of fucking wheat in the world. Bro, these same people that you're talking about feel this way are like the same people like... January 6th never fucking happened. And all them people yeah. should be free. The mm-hmm. shit that happened, like, literally on our turf. Like, it just don't make they sense to like, me. You know what? It was a public building. <laughs> yeah, having, like, right. what, we, what are we talking about? Like, you talking about, basically, all it, to me, it's just, wherever you stand on the opinion, whatever side you on here, you ain't, like, it is what it is. You gonna feel your way. They gonna feel their way. Keep it moving. Mm. It ain't nothing we can do about it at this point. The man gone now, you know. Yeah. Live with the consequences there. The biggest, like, PR thing I think was the fact that there's a uh, Paul Whelan, basically. Yeah. But that guy's still in custody. A lot of people are just like, hey, we left this guy over there. He was a U.S. Marine. You know, the military has this whole thing. You never leave a man behind. We left this guy behind to get her. And I think that's what a lot of people are trying to stand on. Like, that's fucked up. So like, if I'm sitting in a Russian <laughs> prison, I'm probably like, wow, y'all gonna get this. Yeah, for wow. sure. But like I said, though, like Putin's probably just straight up like, we not getting, letting him up. Yeah, that's probably, I mean, it takes you two to party. It yeah, takes yeah, two Putin, to party. Putin like, yo, you can have any of this except for that. But look, if you, <laughs> if you Paul Whelan, you still sitting in jail, you're not trying to hear none of that shit. Nah, you not. You but, like, nah, I'm not trying to hear none of that. Fuck that. But like, you When know, she walking down the stairs to leave the prison, I'm gonna trick the bitch. <laughs> I, like I can see that. I can see that. I'm not saying that's wrong. If I'm the nigga sitting in jail, I'm like, what the fuck? Yeah. <laughs> How you get out? What you do? Are you snitching, Brittany? Yeah. <laughs> you know they only like, oh, she's a rat. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So like, I, I'm not arguing with that. You know what I'm saying? Well, it is what it is for me, man. I don't, I don't condone what she did either, though, because I feel like. You knew, you know what it is. You when know you the went there. Yeah, you knew what it was when you was flying there. You know what I'm saying. I also, at the same time, and you know, this is what I said on in our our we was on the game, and I was like, bro, people got to stop acting like every country outside of America is America. Like the shit that we only just give you a slap on the wrist for. Or we be it's like, big, yo, it ain't no big else. thing. It ain't no big deal. That's a big deal. Other places yeah. like. Well, Qatar, they mean it was acting crazy for the world. Well, right. we would see, we would think it's crazy because of all the Qatar was the, over there arresting people for wearing rainbow shit. Yeah, that's what I'm about to say. Like in Qatar, like they was they no like, alcohol in the stadium. Don't we ain't we 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 don't support gay and homosexual. LGBTQ. Yeah, plus. like we don't support that stuff. Way to clean him up. No, you can say gay. That's a G. It's part of the letters. It's part of the letters. I just yeah. want to get them all in there. <laughs> oh, okay. Like, they don't support any of that. So, you know, they that's a big deal here to where there to where in America you can do what you, do as you please for the most part, you know? Yeah. But so you can't go around. You that. can't go around the world just acting like every place is America. It's not. I think most people believe, like, Rather correctly or incorrectly, no matter where I go, I have these same rights that I have in America. Like, yeah, that I have the right to freedom of speech. Like, well, bitch, actually, you don't. You yeah. think you think she thought she was gonna get away with it because she was a star over there? No, Brittany Griner's probably been playing overseas her whole career, every off season. Yeah. That's what I'm saying, but you so think I'm she, sure do you, she. Do you think she probably just thought like they're not gonna find this? It's, it's probably not the grand. first time. That's yeah. what I'm saying. Like, do you it's think, probably not the first time <clears throat> she's done that. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. But I don't know. If she, I'd have to look to see if she's played in Russia before, but. I mean, it's less than a gram in a vape pen. You know, they probably, that's the type of shit you forget was in your bag, for yeah. real. See, like, if anything, I get caught with this, they just throw it in the trash. Yeah. And keep Let me keep moving, you know what I'm saying? It's yeah, nothing. Because, because that's like an American thing. Like, they ain't really locking niggas up for that here no more. I even, doubt they are in Russia either, though. But. Yeah, true. Even but before, like, it, it was recreational. I think. Even before then, it was like, yeah. yo, like, you get caught with weed on the plane, like, they'd be like, especially like something small, they'd be like, nigga, you know you foul. Yeah. But like, you can't take that on board. Yeah, just throw it out and go. It's like you get foods. there and you got that pocket knife. They say well, it's always that trash can right there. They say oh, you yeah. can throw it in the trash and try to mail it back. Yeah, and they say where's UPS? Oh, it's outside of the check. You like I'm not going back in that line. Choop. Yeah. <laughs> so that I was go. uh, it was last shoot last time we flew uh, when I went out to Cali for the 49ers game. It was this old dude and his wife. It was his little pocket pocket knife. He was like. 
He was like, but honey, I really need my wife. I really need my knife. You know, it's like, that was that's so old. That's dear, near and dear to me, like begging her. She was just like, throw it away. He was like, I really need that mailed to me. I <laughs> divorced It was fun. You can it replace what? it. <clears throat> yeah, but you know, like I said, people need to stop doing that. I, I don't care if you're going to a place where you think is friendly with us. Like, you're going to Jamaica or the you know, Dominican and things like that. Like, don't mess around and think that you can just do whatever you want when you go to these places because they cool. gonna, you don't know. You don't know. You're you a visitor, my you nigga. You don't want to find out how they do it. Right. Man. You don't want to fuck around and find out. You feel me? Exactly. The more you fuck around, the more you find out. You know what I'm saying? And, that, and that's clearly what she did. You I know still, what You know what's crazy? I remember back taking our senior trip to Cancun when we got to the hotel, got up to the room, I'm not going to say no names. Somebody said, how about to roll a blunt? And I said, where the hell did y'all get weed? They said, we just bought it on a plane. Mm. And I was like, that's what's up. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> you just seen Shorty in Cancun smuggling hella weed. Oh, yeah. Like, it, you know? Yeah, yeah. same difference. Yeah. Same thing, yeah. It's so, just... I think there's just a false sense people have. Like, oh, no, you know, if they catch I'm me. American. I throw, I'm, a, I'm, Amer- <laughs> I'm American. I'm American. I'm American, which works in like probably ninety eight percent of the countries, except for the one that we like in a de facto war with. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? They invaded Ukraine. We arming Ukraine. Mm-hmm. We like we don't really fuck with y'all, but we can't say it. Yeah. So our cousin gonna fight you. Yeah. And Brittany Grind over there, like, what's up? Ukraine's crazy too. Ukraine was like Russia and Ukraine thing. Me and her was talking about this the other thing. It was like. Yeah, we about to go whoop up on our little cousins. And they went over there and they was like, oh shit, our little cousins yeah, can fight. Niggas can fight. My cousin grew up. <laughs> he ain't little no more. He ain't little no more. <laughs> <laughs> so, all of that, man. P- politics is something we try to stay at. That. I feel like we try to stay away from. But when you think about it and kind of talk about it, yeah, that's what I say. When you think about it, just kind of bring it back down to like our level, it's like funny. It's hilarious stuff. Yeah. You know? So, so wait, if we talking about this, what do you think like Putin said before he invaded Ukraine? I'm told you. He was like, yo, y'all going to do what? Man, I'll beat your ass. (laughs) 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 You know what I'm saying? He's like, yo, I'm going to walk over and put him in a chokehold real quick. Come back five minutes. <laughs> now yeah. you nigga, you into a long battle and cousin yep. that warp you. You got like, I gotta go back to the drawing board, bro. <laughs> <laughs> nigga been lifting weights. <laughs> so you know, got that. What uh, it is. Oh, I guess it wouldn't be. They say you got the old man strength. Nah, but nah, this <laughs> this family though, they yeah. don't really count. It's just, family you know, business though, you know, you got you can't really you got to count that shit. out. That's kind of like uh. Enter division NFL game. Yeah, you know, it'd be yeah. the, the worst team in the division. Thirteen three and two yep. and six. You be like, ah, it's still a tough oh. game. Yeah, y'all play each other so much. <laughs> All right, man. Rush hour four is in the works, bro. This is real. I don't know if it's real or not. I saw that though. That's what they said. They said it's in the works. Jackie Chan, sixty eight. How Chris old Tucker, is okay? Sixty eight. Sixty eight. Got to be. He was old in the last Karate Kid movie. I didn't know he was. The that last old, Rush though. Hour came out in two thousand seven. So what, what's y'all thoughts? Y'all 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 ready for this movie? Or can they just let it sleep and die? They can let it go to Netflix. It probably would. Net, like yeah. Netflix, I, Netflix. I can see yeah. it happening like that. Rush Hour Four. Mm. It's not like something I'm checking for, but if it was on Netflix, I'll watch it. Can Jackie still go? I'm sure somebody can sit in know, for him. Man. Stunt double. I ain't, I ain't seen him in so long. The At last time I saw him, him, the last time I saw him was what was that movie where, where they was, kidnapped his daughter with Pierce yeah. Brosnan or something? That movie was good. What was the the. Uh, the last time I saw him was Karate Kid with Jaden. No, no, he had one more after that when they when they, <laughs> they kidnapped took his, his daughter. daughter and he went and started blowing up shit and you know he sending them letters. Oh, like, he Look. was old in that movie already too. Yeah, he was old in that movie. Yeah, but he was still kicking ass. He was kicking ass, but he wasn't like Jackie Chan kicking ass. He was just like strategically. He wasn't kicking like ass. Jackie Chan, but he was like that's Jackie. Yeah, that's what that's I think Jackie. you'll get now. Though. Okay, nah, or, this Mr. is what you'll, this is what you'll get now. He ain't so before the big thing about Jackie Chan was like he did all his stunts and stuff. Yeah. No he more. ain't doing that no more. Nah, nah, see, they, they got another nigga. Because, I mean, you do a stunt to like 30 and you break something, like we Paul swimming for like a couple weeks. 68, though? Like, <laughs> you might take you a couple months to recover. You, right? might, you might not wake yeah. up, bro. Yeah, he up top. <laughs> I saw this video. This is off topic, but this was funny, bro. It was like a Christmas video of showing like all your, when your family come over for Christmas, it's like showing all the people. And it was like, Grandpa on the couch in a coma. You don't know if it's a food coma or a real coma. 
I was like, that's crazy. <laughs> I think I seen that. Like, wake him up. Make sure he's okay. <laughs> and the, the little dude touched him, and he woke up like, huh? <laughs> All right, so uh, y'all, I was, you said straight to Netflix. What do you say, Chris? Yeah, I'll check it out if it come out I'm on Netflix. You going to go buy a ticket, though? Nah. So you said Netflix. You, like, I ain't really buying no ticket to go see this movie. There's very few movies I buy a ticket for nowadays. What about you? Would you go see this? At the movie theaters? No. Nah. Yeah. Well, to follow that, what about this Avatar coming out Friday? I, I do want to see that. I don't. I you do. don't? No. Nah. I'm not going to. I'm going to see that. <laughs> I know. That's why I asked you earlier. <laughs> I'm going right. to see that shit. That would be pretty dope in IMAX, though. That's why I asked you earlier, like, yeah. when are you going to see that? And I'm, I'm like, debating if I'm taking my kids the first time. Yeah, see me. I'm, I have you no want to go see it by yourself, dude? I want to go by myself, sneak my half pint of Hennessy in there, <laughs> <laughs> and just chill. Like, give me some me time. See, I, I, I didn't even you. watch the first one until it was out for years. <sighs> really? Yeah, I was not one of them people going to see it in the theater. That was a that, great bro. movie, man. That's it crazy. was cool. I it's kind of like cool. uh, Namor, like their lost cousin or something. Nigga, come on. <laughs> nah, well. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to see. Like, hold on, man. Come because on, they can't man. breathe on the water unless they like attach their hair to the whale hair or some shit. They gotta, they gotta sync up. Yeah, they gotta sync with everything. They yeah, like a yeah. fucking USB drive. Because at first, at first, I was like, you know, y'all took a long time for the shit to come out. But I've been looking at the trailer a little years. bit more. But looking at the trailer a little bit more, I'm well, like, they just released the old one in the theaters like last summer. So you no, like refresh like yeah. last week. So like, you, no, I thought it was like in the summertime. You know, that's just to build the hype back up for this one. Though. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Well, cool. I like when they do that though. But they was doing that. I think. Well, at first, at first, I thought they was doing that to build the hype back up. But I think he did that so that way he can still have that uh, the the box office uh, uh, uh fuck record. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> record. <laughs> well, what took this record? It's probably like Avengers. A Toy Story. Oh, well. Avengers, because Avengers, because Avengers re-released and then he re-released Avatar, but then we just now getting this new Avatar. Hmm. I don't know. Either way, though, I'm, I'm not high on the yeah, I, Avatar. I, I, I want to see it. I want to see it because yeah. the first Avatar was pretty. Damn I'm good. pretty surprised you're not high on the Avatar. I figure like you definitely have to get your kids there to see it. But no. then it gets like a lot of shooting and shit. No, I don't think this is like, definitely not a kid. Not movie. for his kids. Yeah. We'll take Chubbs in him. Yeah, Chubbs is. He already too far. <laughs> yeah, they don't bring him back. He a little don't season. Worry. Yeah, you know what I mean? What about he's you, well Chris? past Disney. No, uh, he's not going to see that. No, I'll see it later on after. I'm not going to go to the movies and see it. Really? Man, you're not hype on it like you. I was hype on the other one, though, but that was how many years ago? 13. Yeah. That's, see, it was 13 years ago, and I probably ain't seen it until probably like eight years ago. I thought the last one was great. Then I remember they said, oh, he did all this stuff to make this movie, this and that. Then I remember, uh, what was it? I forget what year it was, but remember they said James Cameron got this submarine. He went to the bottom of the Marianas Trench and all that shit. And he's going to use what he learned there for his new Avatar movie. And shit. <laughs> that shit happened. I was I like, saw, where's this movie at? I saw a report that they have to make $2 billion just to break even on this shit. $2 billion. Yeah. $2 billion. Yeah. Just Dang. to break even. Oh shit! Some they 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 fucked up. So he needs you to go in there. It'll but go if help people go see it, like they went to go see the first one, though, I think they will. Good. I'm gonna probably see it. I think, well, like, uh, I think the hype is real. Wakanda Forever, like that's right. That's racking in all the money right now. Yeah. If they show up like that, I mean, I guess they're releasing it pretty good because now Wakanda Forever is kind of like dying down a little bit. Like most people that have seen it, that's gonna see it. With so. the movie, like movies Avatar only got two. like a month. Nowadays, I think you'll get like the new people who see it. Like that looks like a great movie, and then you'll get the older people who remember the first one. It's just like nostalgia. Like, oh, I want to see the second. But one. the thing is, though, we the old people. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> but the thing is, you know that the sequels are rarely as good or better than the original. So that was the next thing I had. Like, they they fuck up to a lot of these sequels. Yeah. But what's the Especially what's the best thirteen one? years? Thirteen years though, but like, I don't think Bad Boys was that terrible. Years. I think uh, Rush Hour 2 is better than Rush Hour 1. Okay. What about 3, though? So I thought 3 kind of took a little What happened in yeah, 3? Yeah. What happened in 3? I don't remember. That's how I know it wasn't that great. <laughs> I don't remember 3 at all. Exactly. Was 3 Was three where it was like his brother, Jackie Chan's brother? I don't uh-huh. remember. I remember 2. 2 had the, the massage parlor uh, fight. Right? Okay. 
but I don't remember the. So that was when they were in China. Yeah, number two. They were in China on number two. I don't remember and then number three, three Sue Young was like. Were they getting that little girl back in two? Oh, Sue Young was grown. In three, Sue Young was grown, and, they tried and that's where they were in like Paris. Yep. They were on like the Eiffel Tower. Uh, yeah, yeah. So sometimes thank God for his. You gotta remember, <laughs> <laughs> especially with movies. Like, and it, Fast and Furious. That's why I think too fast, it, it, too furious, gone too far. But that was, but just that was that, just that whole it's, uh, it's gone too movie far. thing. The whole it's gone too far. chain, Fast and Furious. Oh, well, yeah, but like people still go see it though. Even the second Fast Furious, I think, was just as good as the first. The, they probably I, not the better. One were, but it was just as good. Too Fast, Too Furious. The yeah. first Atari's three or four were great. I thought, yeah. like what they when they went Bow Wow drifting in Tokyo and shit. That's when it. That's when it took a turn. I like Tokyo Bow-Wow. Drift. Though. Yeah, no. After no, that, but though. after I'm talking about after that, then it went crazy. Was it? What, no, after that the was one like, after that's when they came back. What's the one where they were in like Mexico pulling a big ass safe with two like hell Dodge Hellcats? Yeah, Brazil. <laughs> yeah, they got two Dodge Hellcats pulling this big ass. <laughs> what was it? Seven when the niggas was in Dubai driving cars through buildings. Bro? I didn't lost track. Yeah, honestly, <laughs> at this point, it's just one. I'm like that was Ronda Rousey control. in that one. Yeah. At this point, it's just one long movie. And then yeah. they went in space. I haven't and seen they went the in space, one. bro. I haven't seen the latest like, one. I don't know about watch space. The I haven't they, watched they, the latest. Ludacris one. Chris goes to space. <laughs> <laughs> that should have been the subtitle. <laughs> Fast and the Furious. Ludacris yeah. goes to space. I was like, this it sounds like it sounds like. <laughs> Ludacris goes to space. It's crazy, but so, then they put like some shit in there. Be like, oh, that's pretty cool. Like the one in Paris where. Uh, was that his brother that had like the little indie cars with the slides on them, where he hit cars and just flip them over? Yeah, him? I was like, man, he, he tough as. Oh, that was Jason Statham's brother. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was that, when they were getting the old girl back because she didn't man. lost her. Yeah, yeah. I was like, okay. And then the, the last movie's kind of crazy, but that dude in that car, I was like, he he a tough. He a and tough then the brother. last one, what's the name? Was his brother? Uh, the other wrestler was his brother. Uh, John Cena was his brother in the last one. The newest one? I think so. I think that's the newest one. Well, John Cena. John Cena is whose brother? Vin Diesel's brother? Yeah. Okay. I think I remember some of that, but I was like, man, I'm not watching that shit. So I'm going to put that down as like one of the worst like sequels. But it, I mean, it's, it's got just, 10 of them, bro. Yeah, but what's like one of the best? The best sequels? Yeah. Did I Die mean, Hard have a sequel? I had, had, Die, Die Hard had, had several. a lot of shit. Did he? I don't, I don't remember. They, 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 they like just made whatever. like the last Die Hard in like 2014 really? where it was in him, him and his son. Yeah, that one was because he had like Die Hard, Die Hard Two, Die Hard with a Vengeance. Okay, like, I remember, that, I remember the video game. Die Hard. Yeah, that was good. That was, was a great game. <laughs> I don't remember that, that game. game. You remember on PlayStation? Game? It had all of it. Was like Die Hard where you had the building. Die like, Hard. That, that that building it was on PlayStation One. Nagasaki Towers. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then you had the on the same disc. I don't know if it was PlayStation One or PlayStation Two. But on the same disc, you had Die Hard with Avengers where you was driving around in the taxi of Samuel L. Jackson. You had to find the bombs. <laughs> <laughs> and then it had Die Hard 3 where you was in the airport terminal. Like, it had all of the movies, but it was on oh. one disc. Shit. But Die Hard had a bunch. Like I said, because okay, then I'll Die Hard off, came dude. back. Die Hard came back where, uh, you know, he had broken relationships with his kids. And then they brought back his daughter first where he had to save his daughter from... A terrorist his dude. actual daughter was in that one, wasn't she? I don't know if that was his actual daughter or not. His daughter. We're gonna put Die Hard in mid, but what is, is Die Hard? Is Die Hard a Christmas movie? Yeah, a lot of people say so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> what were you about to say, Linder? No, what is the best movie and best sequel? One that you use, like you know what they did that right. I like Bad Boys. Bad Boys One and Bad Boys Two were great. Like, but you can't just leave out three. Oh well, yeah, three was good. Three like, was all right, but three wasn't as Wait, good as one and two. Three is the late last one, right? Yeah, yeah. Where Will Smith got shot. Yeah, yeah. That one, I like that one. I, I actually like that one. I think three killed it. I thought three was good. I thought no, three was really good. Two. That one better two. Two was it? Was I didn't, two, two was was up there. Was I didn't two think, one in Miami. See, where, yeah, yeah. Dan Marino. It's hard for me to judge <laughs> bad Marino's boys, car. Though, man, because I, I'm a, all right. The hype was real on hot take right here. Oh shit. Martin Boy, can't act. You a motherfucking liar. <laughs> he can't. You a motherfucking liar. <laughs> like he's funny. He's a great comedian, but he's not a good actor, oh, man. Oh my god. Well, he's got a new movie coming out. I know. You Big Mama's it? house? Terrible, nigga. Don't oh, be terrible. I got this. <laughs> You I, right, I, you I'm got not, hot what's, I, the, what's a good word I for don't this think shit? Martin, Blast me. I don't think Martin is a good actor, <laughs> man. But I do like the Bad Boy series, though. I liked all Have of them. Have you seen you know what movie I'm talking about where mm-hmm. he's like the detective? 
and no. like he's chasing down some some uh, serial killer that like recreates his like art. Mm. What's yeah. the one where he dresses up to deliver the pizzas? Blue Street. Blue, Blue, Blue Street. Street. Even yeah. in that, like his acting is not good, but it's a funny movie. Oh. All right. Well, like most comedians don't, don't like. Us. Most comedians don't like act act like that's what I'm saying. Kevin yeah, Hart plays like, the same role every co- no. comedy movie. Bro. Kevin no, Hart, Kevin Hart, Hart can act. No, 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 no. Okay, now I give you. I'm when talking they, about comedy. They were trying to blackmail him. Yes, nigga. That I movie. Said, oh, Kevin no, no, Hart the upside. The upside. Kevin Hart plays a. The upside. He ain't no comedian in there. No, it's the upside. Good, it's a good movie. Uh, what is it? Daddy's Day or or the, oh with his daughter did that movie was parent? good oh yeah. that movie was really good that movie yeah. was good I ain't gonna lie Kevin Hart he got skills look yeah out, but I'm just saying but I'm just saying aside from that every Kevin Hart comedy movie is the same but he, he plays himself every time so for you to say that about Martin it's like you a hater so nigga I haven't wait. seen. Hold so on, you don't dude, like wait. Martin the show, nigga? No, but his acting is terrible <laughs> yeah. in that show. It's just a I'm funny a, show. Yeah, you don't really judge Martin on his yeah, acting. Yeah, I'm like, it's it's a that, great that it's show. A, it's a great yeah, show. The acting you know, is terrible in Martin, but so, so like, all it's good. You love so down in Martin, so shit. life was a, trash. I still watch Mark. I still watch the Martin show like daily. He didn't do good in life. Life? <laughs> you better not. <laughs> what? <laughs> don't even say little clock. I, 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 I don't. I don't. I don't. say little clock or something. I don't think. I don't think Martin is a good actor, but I, he makes good movies. Oh, it's not shit. the. It's it's different though. I, I don't think Martin's that good of an actor. And all these movies you talking about are like some of my favorite movies. <laughs> Life. Is I just a movie. don't think he acts. Good they should have did a sequel to. Dude, they was how? 90 how? when they got out the goddamn said, oh, like, <laughs> I can't get a sequel of them just watching baseball games, talking shit. I would watch that. Grumpy Old Men then. Exactly. Yeah. That was a good movie though, too. They Grumpy had, Old Men. Like what? One sequel, two sequels? They had like two of those. I only Grumpy seen that one, one time, so I don't really remember it. Remember. I can't. I'm trying to think. I like the bucket list. I too. like Speaking Creed. Grumpy Old Men. Creed? Two. Creed 2 was really good. I like Creed 2. Wait, so you saying Creed is a movie where the sequels are just as good? I thought Creed 2 was just... I thought Creed 2 was might have been even better than Creed 1. I'd rather watch Creed 2 than Creed 1. Okay. Um, I'll go out and say The, the Dark Knight was was a really good sequel. The, the, the Christian one Bell... Was, that was the third Christian, one, though. No, no, no. That was the oh, second one. Oh, okay. The Dark Knight, not the... The Dark Knight was really good. What was the third one? The That's the one with Bane. The Dark Knight... Bang was a good. The one Dark Knight too. Rises. Rises. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. You know how I feel about Bang. I know. Yeah. Yeah. The Dark Knight. The Dark Knight Snapping was good. Back. The Joker. The Joker. Yeah, was, that, that he was. That, that was, was a good one. Legend. Legend. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. That, that was, was a good damn one. Good I paid to the homie. Yeah. That was a damn good sequel. I can't think of one. I just like you know what the sequels were. Just. <laughs> 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 Chef's kiss. You know what I'm saying? I can't think of one. I'm trying. The to Godfather. Think of like, none of those. I don't. Dang, I'm trying to think of. I, I, Goodfellas didn't have a sequel, did it? Not that I know. Of. No, no, not the Goodfellas. I'm sorry. You thinking about the? Uh... Nah, I'm tripping. Oh, oh, you said Godfather. Yeah, I said Godfather. Oh, yeah, yeah. See, that's what I thought you. Were Y'all see about. when they asked LeBron uh, about Godfather, it was like, yeah, LeBron was like, yeah, that's like the greatest, greatest in history. The Godfather. Yeah, it, it was so like, many quotes. What's it your favorite? Like, what's your what's favorite, favorite quote, quote from it? And LeBron was like, oh, it's just so many. It's just too many in the name. You got you to <laughs> oh. cover yourself. Austin Powers. <laughs> Austin Powers oh. was good. Hold on. The Spy Who Shagged was good. Was really yeah, that good. was probably my favorite one, The Spy Who uh, Shagged Me. What's the one with uh, the big fat guy? Was it Goldfinger? That was The Spy Who Shagged Me. Goldfinger. No. Yeah. Oh, no. Get what, in my belly. She was in there, too. Was in, Beyonce was in Goldfinger. Okay. Yeah. But he was in the was other one. Man. The fat dude was in The Spy Who Shagged Me, too, though. He yeah. was like, I'm unhappy because I eat. No, I'm, I, I eat because, because I'm unhappy. unhappy. Yeah, yeah, like that. Funny. And that was when he brought out Mini-Me because he was upset with his son. He was like, you're a failure. <laughs> <laughs> that, one, that was good, That's too. That's for me right that there. That was good, Awesome too. Powers sequels were just as good. All right. Anybody got anything else before we move this along? Nope. Nope. Looking well, forward to that Creed 3, though. I'll I know one that was there. horrible, though, was The Sandlot. Oh, I was going to okay. always okay. ask you about that. What do you think about that sequel? He just that said was it was horrible. 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 Well, I never asked him until now, though. Or I never uh, heard his opinion until now. What didn't you like about it? It was just I never watched it, but I assumed that it was... Well, was it totally a different movie, or was it yeah. like No, it was the movie? same thing, but it was just all new kids. But it was just like... They tried to make it like the same exact movie. Yeah, that's... Like, they didn't change nothing. The Little Rascals have a sequel? Nah, Little Rascals is fucking great, though. Yeah, that sometimes you do it right. <laughs> you don't have to You don't need it. Little Rascals was great. You can still watch that movie. I call my son Alfalfa to this day when he starts singing. 
<laughs> the Mighty Ducks. D two was good. They did a sequel. Hey, D two was good, bro. That's when he came out with the knuckle puck. That shit was serious, bro. <laughs> hey, he it up and then hit that. That was yeah. Hey, D two was good, bro. Mighty Ducks. That's crazy. I, don't I remember know, all these movies, all these songs. You'd be like, "Hey, what'd your teacher teach you in this class?" I'd be like, "I don't really remember." <laughs> Finding Nemo? No, I'm just. They do two movies. They did Toy Dora. Story was one where the sequels were just. Toy good. Story was Toy great. Story two was great. Yeah, that's, All that's the up to Toy Story no. four. Toy Story four was still cool. Toy Story two was and but Toy Story three was great. Toy Story four was good when Woody Toy went Story and did his own was, thing. He Toy was Story like, four. I gotta leave y'all, but just know that my heart with yeah. you. Bro. <laughs> like that was good, bro. Real niggas was in there like I feel <laughs> you, bro. <laughs> yeah. Titanic. Titanic. Ain't no sequel to that. Ain't no sequel to that. <laughs> did you Google that? <laughs> Like, what they brought the ship back to? <laughs> they brought the ship out the ocean. Hey, the oh, sequel would be a horror movie. The sequel would be ghosts. The sequel would be all ghosts. <laughs> the sequel's Walking Dead. My nigga Jack, like I can't believe it, <laughs> bro. She straight. It was room up there for Jack. Bro. <laughs> Come on, you can't tell me you got a big ass door and Jack can't get on the door. My nigga just slipped off. Like you gonna literally hold my hand till I freeze to death. You a Rotten ass bitch, man. <laughs> That's crazy. He is upset. Oh, hey, shit. She wouldn't hold it down. There was so much room. Like, all she had to do <laughs> it was, so was like, room. you get on one half, I'm going to jump on the other half. She, like, sat in the middle and then was like, oh, every time you try to get up here, it's going to tip over. There's no room. <laughs> like, do you It's because all the weight is on this side. <laughs> and that was 1912, though, bro. They might not have been up on physics. Bro, like they that. had built the ship. They that knew is physics. True. That is yeah, true. And then I'm like, what? <laughs> that is true. Well, the, they built the ship. The smart people built the ship. She was. No, she she knew, probably bro. wasn't that educated, man. She what about there Because she was marrying that, for money. She was in there steaming up that Model T. Let my man on that she damn was door. There, she was up there marrying for money, so she ain't probably had that much. What about the Matrix? Oh, That's one that man. I can honestly say I've never watched it outside of the first one. Mm. I don't remember the Matrix, so I'm gonna probably say no for me. Okay, by John Wick. Oh, I never seen none of John those. Wick Two. Is five. All of John Wicks. I, I never watched four too. Yeah, I've been seeing that one too. You haven't watched John Wick? No. Oh shit, nigga. John Wick's a killer. Yeah, you yeah, haven't watch watched John any of them. He like, a dog. If, you just, if you're ever in the John mood, Wick is watch. what I be trying to tell y'all to do on Call of Duty. <laughs> <laughs> No, yeah. damn well you ain't doing no John Wick shit on Call hey, of Duty. If you ever just want to watch a movie where it's just non-stop gun busting, blood guts, watch John Wick. Hmm. Or you can watch any Quentin Tarantino movie. Well, that's true. Quentin. Django. They need to do a Django too, man. Oh, yeah, I'd pay to see that. Django too, because mm-hmm. the first one was amazing. Ah, you know what? Don't do a Django too, because the first one was so good. I can just keep watching that one, bro. Yeah, I don't yeah, that's, that's one of them ones that you just leave like it Pulp there. Fiction, like. You can leave that. Just leave it there. Some some, some mm. of them you just got to leave there. Oh, uh, what did y'all think about this? Did y'all ever watch the Independence Day sequel? I did. What did you think about I, that? I think it didn't yeah. hold up to the hype. It wasn't a bad movie, but it it's hard bad. to... It was hard to... I didn't do it. You didn't watch it at all? No. Uh, it wasn't bad, and I like how they tied everything together. They had the dad go out there and, like, you know, oh, he was old, kind of wacky now and shit. Yeah. But where was I don't Vim? remember it. She died. She was in there. She died Why on top of the helicopter. Him? I remember the... Yeah, he had to do that. He was like, Mom! <laughs> this dude had just flew his jet to the moon, bro. Like, you can't get there in time? Like, you know what I'm saying? He can Nah, because she was trying to get on the helicopter. So what was the story? Why was Will Smith not in the movie? He died. How? Yeah. Fighting aliens, Fighting right? aliens yeah. or something. He yeah. did. Yeah. But yeah. they son, the little dude from the first one, right. had grown up. Yeah. And then he was a, now he's a yeah. airman, you know what I'm saying? So, okay. and uh, he's a fuck. Oh, he wasn't a fuck up. His boy, was his boy, he, he said he almost killed him. It was beefing the whole movie. Yeah. And then the president's daughter, the little girl, was dating the fuck up. Yeah, uh. <laughs> <laughs> they said they said they shooting a sequel to uh, damn, what's the movie he had when he was like the last nigga on earth? Oh, uh, I'm a legend, yeah, oh, yeah. So, see, Michael B. Jordan's gonna be in that, hmm. but I was like, how do you do that? I feel like Michael B. Jordan's that guy. Like he's like the new hell. Will Smith. Like yo, you stole him in something. Like, yeah, that's we what I'm saying. He tickets. like the new Will Smith. Yeah. Like, like Will anything. Smith was able to blockbuster all those movies. Like, that's Michael B. Jordan now. Like mm. if you think about, I'm Legend. Will Smith literally walked around New York City by himself, talking to himself. Yeah, and we paid to With watch that shit. We did, and I was like, hmm, it's kind of good. But it was good. Yeah, it was good. But now, if you put, I don't know, name an actor. 
Could Nicholas Cage. I mean, I mean, Tom Hanks did it on the beach, <laughs> nigga. Wait, but Tom Hanks, though. <laughs> Every time I see a soccer ball, I be like, Wilson. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. Like, that shit was tough. Yeah. That's true. I ain't never felt bad for me losing this ball in my life. <laughs> 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 what'd y'all think about all right, bro, right, bro, before we move on what'd you think about the uh, the sequel to the uh, the Tom Cruise sequel to the uh, what, the Mission Impossible not the Mission Top Impossible Gun? Top Gun yeah I oh. haven't watched that yet you haven't watched that I, I, that motherfucker I, was good I don't bro. is it on one of the streaming sites yeah, yeah yeah I watched it Which like one? in the summertime all of them no nigga not we not gonna say. Oh, no you talking way. about the legit one? Yes. Oh, yeah. I don't. You know, I, I can't speak to that. I have no idea. It, they just put it back in theaters. Really? Yeah. I might go. Top Gun, bro. That, bro, that, that mug shit was great. That mug was great, bro. Yeah. But we're gonna move on. Cause yeah. I can talk about that for hours. We can talk about <laughs> movies for a long time. Yeah. People took. They took. The people took our movie show segment away from us because they said they wasn't watching it or listening oh, to yeah, it. Oh, yeah, that's We true. had a segment. They took we that did, away from us. We, we was just doing like a power review. Congratulations. Sean Combs, 53, announced the birth of his seventh kid. Is that a congratulations? <laughs> congratulations, my nigga nuts still work. Is that, is that what that is? Or is that an oops? <laughs> the, the, uh, is it really his name is you? Love Sean Combs. What? He changed his name to like Love, didn't he? No, that's his name, right? Or that, no, that's, that's the baby's name. Love Sean Combs. Hmm. It's a girl? It's a girl. And you... Uh, bro, are you, can, are you still like be tripping off of the way these celebrities name their No, kids? no, no. After after Elon Musk had his baby and he named it like a fucking formula, I'm like, I'm cool. I don't trip off What's of the way Elon's none of these people name their kids. It's like AX plus oh, B or something yeah, like that. No, it must have like a weird character in that movie. No, it ain't. Yeah, it, bro, it's something it crazy, something bro. It's something crazy. I'm a, like, Google it, Johnny. Like, like You bro. can't Google it because you can't type that character on that movie. But you're going to have to type in Elon gonna Musk's st- baby name. They're going to start uh, naming kids nuts. with emojis. <laughs> I don't I, 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 Bro. Bro, it's, it's crazy Bro what the hell I'm supposed to do? <laughs> what, what, what do you want me to do with this Look at this what nigga's name name's name fam. <laughs> This is her name What is that What formula is that for Pi square Nigga <laughs> I know it's something weird I don't know. It looks like Newton. Bro, it's letters Newton's on the goddamn calculator, man. I don't know what this is. <laughs> <laughs> physics calculator. This is crazy. No, but congratulations to Diddy. 53. Had another baby. That's what's I up. remember he was like, like I looked up to Diddy a little the, bit. The baby's name is Love Sean Combs? Yes. Hmm. So our first name is Love. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Love Sean Combs. Yeah. But it's like, it's I don't know. It's, I don't know. Like, weird. That's kind of some asshole shit. Yeah. It's a little weird. Just you better like, love your daddy. Like, what's your son name? <laughs> love Lindary Council. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the great Lindary Council. Like, it's like saying, I about? love myself. And I yeah. I love myself so much, I named you after me. Did y'all see uh, Diddy get into it with 2-Bit? Yeah. Did y'all see that he video? Well, he was but the joker. Like, 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 oh, he looked kind of crazy, for real. I'll bust you. I was like, wondering, man. like, I was teeter-tottering, like, is he in character, or is he really, like... He was, like, both. He was yeah, in like, character, yeah. and then he came out, like, nigga, don't you ever talk to yeah, me like I'm that. Like, I'm like, but uh, 2-Bit was like, nigga, you... What's up? I, did, did you think 2-Bit <laughs> knew it was Diddy at first? Yeah. I'm sure he did. They was probably at a party or something. Well, he the case, but he's like, yo, dog, to you me, think, he was a bitch. You so think what? Diddy is with the shits? I've heard... I think I've watched... And I've heard enough about Diddy to know that he ain't necessarily soft. Him or somebody else is with it. Yeah, no, I know no, he's got, he got I know some he people got here and dear to him that can do something. Got, no, I've heard, I've heard like a bunch of stories about, and I've watched interviews with people that have been close to him and things like that. Like a lot of people say, like he got an attitude and he like he ain't afraid. He ain't of afraid. His work. Yeah, like he oh, okay. ain't afraid. He ain't running from it if it's coming. I, oh, okay. more or less, you know what I'm saying? Okay. So. But then at the end, he was like, I well, love at the end, you. He a businessman. I love you. At the end, he a businessman <laughs> who's like, yo, I can... It seemed like, from what I understand, mostly about him, is like he always think like, yo, I, I will lose more if I engage in this confrontation than I gain. I respect it. So... Like, this is too big for power. Word, right? Like, really? Who are right. you arguing with? Like, <laughs> but honestly, though, if you saw too big, you probably want some smoke with that motherfucker, too. He was... Snitching and shit. <laughs> fuck, fuck. Oh, yeah, he was. <laughs> I was like, where did Larry go with this? I'm just saying, like, like what's his, was Tariq? Tariq. Still don't fuck with you. 
I know. I, mi- mm-hmm. I missed that show, though. I'll tell you that. That's much. how I know he's a good actor, though. He like, people don't fuck with me like that. Nigga, like. He's like, man, it was, it was a show. It's make believe. I seen him on an <laughs> elevator like that. <laughs> yeah, he was I think like, that was yo. stage. It was stage. I think it was but... stage, but dude walked up like, why you kill your dad, bro? Like, he was <laughs> yeah. like, it was a show. It was a show. <laughs> Tariq, yeah, it was all that. Yeah. <laughs> all right, last one before we get out of here. Y'all see this video, this pit bull eating a Tesla? Unfortunately, yes. No, Not I even unfortunately, bro. This bro, I dumb. It. I didn't see it. Pit, I guess you Bro, this pit bull going bull ham bull on his Tesla. Up, you think it's shit. a steak. Yeah. No <laughs> but shit. All on the door, ripping off the, the back. The back by the wheel. He didn't bit it up yeah. and pulled it off. It ripped off the uh, lining around the door. She recording it on her phone the yeah. whole time. This mm. must be one of those. Uh, it's in the group chat, ain't it? Yeah. I'm yeah. Say this, did they I sent it. Was? No, I sent I it in there. I, I would guess it's like one of these northeastern states where they don't have, you know, they don't have the right to carry guns like that for real. Hopefully. But still, I'm like, I would have just drove Drove off. No, I got to kill that dog. Bro, as soon as the dog jumped on my car, I would have just drove yeah. off. Why are you still sitting there? I got to kill that dog. She didn't even open the, the window. Oh, shit. She even opened the window for the dog. Now. Slobbering all in the Me, test. today, in the Benzo, you would shot that dog. I would have popped the dog. <laughs> <laughs> or, or you went too far. <laughs> what the dog But like if I'm in a state where I can't have a <laughs> pill. Dog like, yeah. no, that doesn't sound like a seal. If I'm in a state where I can't have the pill. Then I'm going to just drive off. With the blicky. I don't understand that. Like, this dog was dismantled. Totally like, this dog dude. was dismantled in this Bro, car. People love attention. Like, are you going to get more people to look at your little shit if you drive off? Or if you sit there and be like, look at this dog. This Bro, if my it testing. ain't sitting on this couch recording this podcast, I ain't looking for attention. No, like, the but, police, <laughs> like, the police are, was though. sitting there and everything. The police are like, what you, I mean, why the are we here? sitting there? Yeah. what they do? Watching they are looking at it like motherfucker having to protect the <laughs> It's like we the police, we ain't animal control. Why you call us? Because they can shoot. They should have tased the dog. Yeah, bro, the police will shoot a dog quick. If they Man, yeah, if they go that dog, in. that dog wasn't harming that woman. So does that mean that Teslas are overpriced and it's a really a cheap car? They ain't made a steel. They ain't made, yeah, I'm about to say they plastic. Really, yeah, they really yeah. plastic cars. They got to keep the weight down on them so that that battery don't That's drain true, so fast. Man. You know, so. I'm like, I ain't blaming Tesla for this. <laughs> what no. the fuck, Elon? <laughs> you need to make heavier car. <laughs> you need to make it like the... this thing right on up. You got to make it like the, the Ford Model T. Yeah. Bet that dog won't bite a Ford Model T. <laughs> that thing bite back. I <laughs> should <laughs> yeah. ah, That's crazy. I, I would have got out, shot the dog, and I'd probably just... It ain't bite wife. no box Chevy. My wife had an incident like this. Not like this, but like earlier this week, she calls me and was like, babe, like these dogs came down the block and like just jumped in the car. And I'm like, what you mean just jumped in the car? Like in the car? In the car? Yeah, in the car. And I'm like. I'm Your like, car? Yeah, my car. Or the, uh, I mean, it don't matter. A vehicle that y'all the, own. Yes, nigga. Like. <laughs> She, and what she do? She said that was nice. She said it was a big. It, it was nice. Yeah, it, it was. What? It was a big one and it was a little one. It was both little pit bulls. So the one she she took the big one out. A little one jumped in, and then she took the little one out, and then the big one Why did jumped she shut back the in. door. What happened? What's going on? She was trying to keep the ba- the dogs away from the babies and uh, shit. Because my do- my daughter's like wants to. She like wants to touch it. Then she was like, you know what? Why don't you I throw don't, a piece of bologna out there and get them both out? Well, who carry around bologna what, a little? Who even stars? got who got bologna at the house? I was gonna say, nigga, like we ain't had no. I don't even know the <laughs> who last got time bologna I had at the house, bologna. bro. I don't, whatever meat you got, my mom, <laughs> my mom Your does. Your mom still eating bologna? Bro? Yeah, my kids eat but that's bologna old sandwiches. School. That's I don't wild. eat bologna like if I get the cold cut. Something Never, something. nigga. No, if I you so if you go to Subway, you'll get a bologna. I'll get the cold cut with bologna and salami. I like that. Oh, I ain't ate bologna in twenty years. Yeah, thirty. I eat salami. I ain't ate bologna since I was probably like I five. Man, I'm getting but my kids eat bologna at, at their grandma's. Y'all, why are y'all doing that to your kids? Y'all too good to eat bologna. It's now, protein. It's no, protein. It's like, I don't know. I used to eat that with my grandpa. But I ain't eat no bologna, So bro. do y'all eat salami? No. I haven't had salami in them forever. Oh, fuck up. With the big salami. pepper peppers in there. In there. <laughs> I ain't eating that shit. I get like crunchy. A, <laughs> you stuck in your tooth. What's up, nigga? The closest thing I like eat to salami pit. is like it's summer sausage. You give me bro. some sausage, you know. Yeah, salami is so there. much better than summer sausage. Nah, I'm cool, bro. I can't. Y'all, y'all acting real to do now. Think because I don't want to eat real what? <laughs> real to do. I still eat ramen noodles, <laughs> fam. Like don't don't go there. You eat the ones in the cups now. No, though. I don't. <laughs> you don't want to. I think that's a cup of noodles. Oh, that's all the best ones. Yeah, yeah, I don't yeah. eat 
those. A cup of noodles. I don't I still eat the, the, pack, the pack, like, bro. No. Like, I'm not. I need my little silver. A little man silver. gotta have pride. I still don't. I still can't believe they got restaurants for this shit. I'm like. Yeah, niggas, for the, niggas, for the ramen. niggas been doing this for years. And so y'all gonna throw an egg in there and try fourteen yeah, dollars? I said I'd be damn if I made. You ever had some shrimp? Some gourmet still, noodles, nigga. Oh, I still, I, I make chub noodles. I put the egg in there and shit. I have a whole so you just do it like at home? This. Yeah. Uh, I didn't see it, but I needed it. <laughs> I told, I told my daughter <laughs> I'll take her on a date to go do that, but I'm like, I really go get some noodles. She want to do a little ramen spot one time, so. You just go in the kitchen, pack open that, this nigga, I can pop do that, that pack bro. open, put that chicken season to the side, Are you, and do your thing, huh? Ooh. Yeah. Are you right. watching football over there? Yeah. Of course he what is. The, that's all I got, man. <laughs> I'm done. I'm got. fucking done. <laughs> Be damned if y'all go to sleep on me. <laughs> I ain't going to sleep. I'm wide awake over here. All right, man. Let me get us some words of wisdom. We I got to find done. them, bro. Is y'all true? Is y'all true? I gotta look through like two. You don't eat the noodles in the cup? Yeah. I, I haven't in a while. I don't like the I was thinking about, well, see, when we had that. They little, are different. They like flat. When, when we had that, little, what was it called? The little the little store in the office? I was tearing them cup of noodles. Uh, up. Yeah. Was you paying for them, though? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. No, you wasn't. <laughs> Damn. I was. I should have wore a nips. Hey, this like, is a good one from Nipsey. You owe me 40 bucks for this door. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> uh, bro. What? The trust system was real in the Mini Mart, boy. Like, I got him. Mini Mart, that's what it was. I got called. you, bro. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> man. Hey, I remember. Hold no, on. No. <laughs> Nope. That nigga was charging like a dollar for that water. Chris was like, I'll be damned if I pay for this water. <laughs> you got four. That was got- like the thought on a whole lot of stuff. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man. Where's the wisdom again? Coming from my uh, my Ghost Rider, Root Star. Shout uh, out to Root Star. Get out. better. She sent me like, yeah, get better. Get better. <laughs> <laughs> nigga look like <laughs> what are you doing over here? Um... She uh, sent me a bunch of Nipsey quotes a while ago. I told her I had like a bunch of uh, Crenshaw hoodies and sweater or and sweatshirts. Oh, because you did the four for a hundred thing. Five for a hundred. It was a good yeah. deal. But uh, even though I'm not wearing one today, I want to go with this one. Now. He rolled them sixty. <laughs> yeah, ain't none of them red, so you know what it is. They look like Heathcliff today. <laughs> Heathcliff Huxtable. This is a nice sweater, bro. <laughs> is that a good thing or a is bad that your thing? Ugly, this is a nice is that your sweater. ugly sweater? Is, is, it a different... not, is it ugly, bro? Oh. <laughs> this is a nice sweater. It looks like express. A, it's warm. Ugly sweater. It's not. It's, it's ugly. A sweater. Oh, Damn. So you calling my sweater ugly, bro? I thought you went to the ugly sweater party, bro. <laughs> Boy, okay. I see you niggas hey, don't know shit hate, about fashion. Nigga hating on your pinwheels, bro. <laughs> <laughs> hey, look, look. That was snowflakes, man. I think these niggas are stupid, bro. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, hey! Did y'all know that pinwheel, pinwheels keep the moles away? I did. Yeah, it's supposed to. I don't know if it's true. I still got moles. Go Most, ahead. Before you, moles. before your words of wisdom, I want to see if y'all know something. Go ahead. Did you know that R. Kelly released an album on Friday and they snatched it off? You could have saved that for your section. Oh, okay. They didn't release it. <laughs> That's true. Too. He said he didn't release it. He said somebody else did. That's true. Too. <laughs> We do got a whole second. Hey, <laughs> tune into the corner. <laughs> he trying to. Words of wisdom oh, man. from second. Nipsey Hustle. The game is going to test you. Never fold. Stay 10 toes down. It's not on you, it's in you. And what's in Damn. you, they can't take away. Nipsey Hustle. Repeat it. Oh, one more time. Jay Z. Just one more time because we was talking during him in my back. The oh. game is going to test you. Never fold. Stay 10 toes down. It's not on you, it's in you. And what's in you, they can't take away. Mm. Your pride. That's right. Nipsey Hustle. Your heart. Your heart, yeah. Take us out of here, Keenan. He's a dog. <laughs> you the dog. Y'all know I kill <laughs> <laughs> I admit it. Tell a friend, tell a friend, then tell your mama. We about this. Ain't cousins too. Bye. One. Boom. Out of here. Peace. And love. <laughs> <laughs>